I'm in the Hay River in the Northwest Territories. Here, the community relies primarily on the Lake Whitefish commercial fishery, and almost the entire catch is exported. Stacy Linnington is the president of the Northwest Territories Fishermen's Federation. Like many fishermen in his hometown, he fishes for Lake Whitefish in Great Slave Lake, the deepest lake in North America. Stacy, you chose a place bigger than life to live and fish, eh? You bet. Commercial fishing is what I like to do, and this is where I like to do it. You've been fishing all your life? Uh, since I was about 20 years old, okay. so 37 years. And you're fishing a lot of it. Well, we're catching just over, right around a million pounds a year right now, but the, this lake has a sustainable quota of over three million pounds a year. So we're fishing a lot, but there's a lot more to be fished. And you said the sustainable part is really important, not only for you, but everyone that is actually fishing on the lake. Well, even beyond that, I've got a grandson that's four years old. He's probably going to fish when he's 40 years old. Yeah. And so this, this lake has to sustain me and my sons and, and their sons. So. Everyone. You bet. In the morning, very early, you leave with your boats, and what happens? Well, you head out to your nets and you start yeah. to fish, and you uh, grab onto your buoy and you start to pull your nets on, and you pick the white fish out. Yeah. They're put into a box with ice, and then they come off the boats here, here. and they go straight to the fish plant. And, and what happened at the fish plants? They grade them, and they put them into a slurry, and from there they go to Winnipeg, and then from there they go all uh, over the world. All over the world, because yeah. people love this white fish from the Northwest Territories. That's right, and when people have had it, they don't want to be without it. It's a, it's a good product. And it's a place where also the First Nation are very, I'd say, like into it too, and you're working together. Yeah, the First Nations fishers are probably the best fishers we have. They're just great people to work with. They're the best on the lake. They are, yeah. <laughs> they know how to fish. And they, they enjoy it. They're not intimidated by the water. They'll go hard for the whole season. They're a great bunch. The whitefish is the, probably the least known of all the freshwater fishes, and, and it's the healthiest and probably the, the most sustainable of, of all of them. And it's the ones that we're after, the ones that we're most fond of as commercial fishermen. And you guys are behind it, so you must be proud of that. You bet. <laughs> In 2016, 22 million pounds of whitefish were caught in Canadian lakes. 90% of the fishermen in Hay River are First Nations descent. They have managed to preserve their way of life and create an industry that is recognized around the world for its high quality. That's why we are the best. Mm -hmm.